This is White Knight King Productions and this is going to be a VHS update for November 16th, 2015. Let's start off with the 1991 VHS of Texasville with Jeff Bridges and Sybil Shepard. A Peter Bogdanovich picture. Films from 1990 and this is from Nelson Entertainment. This is the sequel to The Last Picture Show. Two thumbs up. A fresh look at the way men and women relate to each other since the late Cisco and Ebert. This is rated R and it's 126 minutes. And this is code distributed by RC Columbia Pictures Home Video. Here's the vertical ink label and there is no print date. And next up is the 1995 VHS of the Three Stooges, The Outlaws Is Coming, a full-length, gun-swinging, rip-roaring feature film. Films from 1964. And this is... 90 Minutes. This also features Adam West and Nancy Kovac. Here's the sticker label, and there is no print dates. And next up is the 1984 VHS of The Magnificent Seven, with Yul Brynner, Eli Wallach, and the late Steve McQueen. Films in 1960. This is from CBS Fox Video. They fought like 700. And this is 127 minutes. Here's a sticker label, and there is no print date. And next up is the 1997 VHS box set of America in the 40s. A Sentimental Journey, and this is from Reader's Digest Video. Here's the first tape, which is 1940-42. to 42. As you may know, I showed, the, I have the 1998 VHS of this, of this tape from Warner Home Video. And this is 60 minutes, so it's exactly an hour. And this is still sealed. Here's the second tape, which is 1942 to 1945. And this is a documentary series from 1997, if I forgot to mention that. Again, exactly an hour. And here's the third tape, which is 1945 to 49. And all of these are sealed, which is very rare. Again, exactly an hour. And next up is the 1986 VHS of The Goonies, directed by Richard Donner, and this stars Sean Astin. Films in 1985. And this is a rare one right here. A delicious sweet dizzy adventure with crowd pleasing fun, says Kathleen Carroll of the New York Daily News. This is rated PG and it's 114 minutes. And I was looking for this one for quite a while. Here's the sticker label and the end label. It has the tan lid on there. And next up is the 1987 VHS of Cujo with D. Wallace. From Stephen King's novel comes a chilling tale of a quiet New England town and a horrible evil in the dead of summer. Now there's a new name for terror. Films from 1983. 
Your most horrible fear is the one that comes true. This is rated R and it's 93 minutes. Here's the sticker label and the end label. This came from TNT Video. And next up is the 1990 VHS of Penn and Teller Get Killed with Penn Jouette and Raymond Teller. Films from 1989. What more do you want? This is another rare one right here. A hip black comedy says we're gonna have newspapers. This is rated R and it's 90 minutes. It also says check out Penn and Tower's Cruel Tricks for Dear Friends. Here's the sticker label and the end label. And next up is the 1984 VHS of Christine with Keith Gordon, John Stockwell, Alexandra Paul, Robert Prosky, and Harry Dean Stanton. Films from 1983. And this is based off a novel by Stephen King. And this is rated R and it's 110 minutes. Another rare one. Here's the sticker label and the end label. Again, came from TNT Video. And next up is the 1988 VHS of Beetlejuice with Michael Keaton, Alec Baldwin, and Gina Davis. Films from 19, uh, also from 1988, The Name and Laughter from The Hereafter. An uproarious ghost comedy. There hasn't been anything like it since Ghostbusters as Kevin Thomas of the Los Angeles Times. This is rated PG and it's 92 minutes. I know some of these tapes are former rentals, but if I forget to mention a former rental sticker, I'll put it in the annotations. Here's the sticker label and the end label. And next up is the 1992 VHS of The Lawnmower Man with Jeff Fahey and Pierce Brosnan. Based on a story by Stephen King. And this is the under, un, unrated director's cut. The film is also from 1992. And this is... I couldn't... See the running time on this one. Bob printing the annotations. And next up is the 1984 VHS of Firestarter with Drew Barrymore. Will she have the power to survive? The film is also from 1984. And this is rated R and it's an hour and 53 minutes. And it says, plus a special look at other MCA attractions. Here's the sticker label and the end label. Which say 1983 on there, but that's totally incorrect. And next up is the... 1988 VHS of Lifeboat, directed by Alfred Hitchcock, and this is part of the Alfred Hitchcock collection from Key Video. Films from 1944. Toria Bankhead stars in a Hitchcock tour de force. The running time is 96 minutes. Here's a sticker label, and this came from Video Max in Three Oaks, Michigan. And 
And next up is the 1988 VHS of Monkey Shines, directed by George A. Romero. An Experiment in Fear. The film is also from 1988. This is from Orion Home Video. This is rated R and it is 113 minutes. Here's the inkable and there's no print dates. And next up is the 1993 VHS of Jason and the Argonauts. Special effects by the late Ray Harryhausen. And this star is Todd Armstrong and Nancy Kovac. Films from 1963. And this is Rated G and it's 104 minutes. It has a 1991 copyright for some reason. And the, most of these, except for the last two I got at a first tour, well, the last two I got at Goodwill. Here's the sticker label, and there's no print dates. And the last tape I have is the 2002 VHS of Death, Death to Smirchy, with the late Robin Williams, Edward Norton, and Danny DeVito, who also directed this movie. The film is also from 2002. And this is rated R for language and sexual references, and it's 109 minutes, and the extras are 11 minutes, which are bloopers and additional scenes. Here's the ink label, and the print date is September 5th, 2002. And that's going to be it from the VHS update, and I'll see you later.